Hi, Dr. Sullivan, Sullivan Dermatology. I want to show you a really important uh, uh, patient and a case, something that you need to know about. So if you look here, you can see this rash tracking down this gentleman's legs. And you can see, if you really look at it, that it's grouped. So it means it's clustered. All right. And that clustering is a real giveaway that what we're seeing is we're seeing herpes zoster. So herpes zoster is also known as shingles. It's caused by the chickenpox virus. And later in life, that chickenpox virus, which has remained dormant in your body an entire lifetime, travels down a nerve and it, it causes almost like a localized form of chickenpox. And the word herpes is a description of that grouping, how it gets grouped like this. I'm gonna ask the gentleman who's kind enough to let me film this a couple questions. What did it feel like when it uh, started? Itchy. Itchy? Did you think maybe you had a bug bite or something had bitten yeah. you? Or, yeah. yeah. So a very common scenario, people tell me they have an itch or a little discomfort. It's just annoying. So they'll feel like a little annoying scratch or a little annoying itch. And then a day or two later, the um, rash will appear. So if you ever get that kind of annoying itch and you think you might have a bug bite or something like that, uh, just have it on your radar that it could be shingles. I'm gonna ask him another question. How old are you? 56. 56, all right. At 50, he could have gotten his shingles vaccine. He would have had a sore arm for a day or two, but then he could have avoided that. I know vaccines are kind of controversial these days. However, you can completely avoid this with the shingles uh, vaccine. Uh, the first thing I did when I turned 50, besides moan, was um, get the shingles vaccine. So what we're gonna treat him with is we're gonna treat him with an antiviral pill that works best if it's taken within the first uh, 24 to 48 hours of uh, the rash occurring. And so for that reason, if you ever suspect you have shingles, you should get into the doctor right away. If you call my office and say it's an emergency, we understand it's an, an emergency because we wanna get you on that medicine. And then we're gonna give them a medicine called gabapentin, which helps with the discomfort that comes with shingles. And that's the big problem with shingles is some people after the shingles will have something called post herpetic neuralgia or neuropathy, and that can last for many months and be very painful. Thanks.